Hi everyone, this is Fahad Mirza and I welcome you to the channel. Meta has released this new attention mechanism and in this video I am going to explain it in as simple words as possible. I am not assuming that you are a machine learning guru or you have built models from scratch. So let's get started. The attention mechanism is a key concept used in large language models like transformer based models. Attention allows the models to choose relevant information from a large amount of data when making predictions by selectively paying attention to certain parts of inputs and ignoring others. In standard attention mechanism, each input token, word or subword is converted into three vector representations called query for Q, key for K and value for V. Each query is compared to every key using a dot product, giving weights that measure relevance. These weights determine how much each value vector contributes to the final output. But a fundamental limitation is that such standard attention matches only single pairs of tokens at a time, each query token with each key token individually. This we call it single token attention. This paper by Meta discusses this new method called as multi-token attention or MTA that expands on this idea. Instead of comparing just single pairs of query key vectors independently, MTA enables the attention calculation to jointly consider groups or sequences of tokens. In other words, MTA lets queries and keys nearby in context influence one another's attention weights using convolutional operations applied across tokens and attention heads. This makes it possible for the model not just to find individual tokens like Alice and Rabbit separately, but also to easily identify situations that require multiple relevant tokens to appear close together so locating exact positions more precisely. The architecture of MTA slightly modifies the conventional attention mechanism by introducing convolutional operations over three dimensions, queries, keys and attention heads. This simple modification allows attention weights to become richer as each query key pair can now incorporate information from adjacent tokens vectors and even from other heads, greatly enhancing precision in finding relevant context. In practice, this means the model can perform better, especially in tasks where pinpointing exact context from multiple hints is crucial, such as searching for complex phrases or concepts buried deep in longer contexts. In summary, Multi-token attention enhances standard transformer models by allowing for attention weights to depend on multiple related tokens simultaneously. This improvement is achieved via convolutional structures resulting in nuanced attention decisions and improved performance on tasks involving long and complicated inputs. And I am more than sure we are going to see this in various models going forward. So stay tuned as soon as I see a model which is released on the basis of this multi-token attention, I am going to show it to you in the hands-on fashion. Before I let you go, let me also thank our very good friend that Camel AI who are sponsoring this video. Camel is an open source community focused on building multi-agent infrastructures for finding the scaling laws with applications in data generation, task automation and world simulation and I will also drop the link to their website in video's description. Please like and share the video and if you haven't already subscribed, please also do me a favor and subscribe to the channel. Thank you very much.